Elvis didn't have a son, but this Presley boy seems to be carrying on the musical family legacy. What's the story with Lisa Marie's half-brother, Navarone Garibaldi? When you are part of the Presley family, you're music royalty. That was certainly true of Elvis and Priscilla's only child, Lisa Marie Presley. And some are willing to extend that status to Lisa's only sibling, half-brother Navarone Garibaldi, even though he's not a blood relation to the King of Rock. In fact, Garibaldi never even had the opportunity to meet Elvis because he was born 10 years after Elvis' death in 1977. Still, Garibaldi is forever linked to the man known as the Memphis Flash. And for better or worse, the extended family of Elvis always have a ton of attention heaped upon them, all because of their connection to the king. After Elvis and Priscilla divorced in 1973, Priscilla never remarried, but she had several romantic relationships that included lawyer Robert Kardashian, billionaire businessman Kurt Kerkorian, and British photographer Terry O'Neill. But by far her longest relationship was with Brazilian screenwriter and producer Marco Garibaldi, a partnership that lasted more than two decades. The two met when a mutual friend introduced them in 1984. They moved in together almost immediately, and their only son, Navarone Anthony Garibaldi, was born on March 1, 1987, in Santa Monica. Like many children of Hollywood celebrities, Navarone got into some trouble as a teen, which included a DUI, but he also had a number of hobbies, including collecting reptiles and nature photography. Being born into a family of musicians could be daunting, or it could be a blessing. Maybe it's both. But in 2013, Navarone Garibaldi co-founded the band Them Guns, performing as the lead vocalist and guitarist. Them Guns considers itself a synth rock band with dance-evoking progressive sound, according to the band's website. The band has played in some of the most iconic Los Angeles music venues, including the Viper Room and the Troubadour, and they've toured internationally as well. In 2015, Them Guns contributed tracks for the independent film Shut Up and Drive. According to Priscilla Presley, Garibaldi likes doing independent projects and flying below the radar. In some ways, he seems almost allergic to the attention that the Presley name could bring him. Presley told The Guardian in 2012, My son Navarone is his own person. He wants to do his own thing, and I'm really proud of him. He doesn't want to step into the spotlight, and he's always been that way. He's not riding on Elvis, and he's not riding on Lisa. Presley said that it could have been daunting for a child growing up in that family to have the reputation of Elvis hanging over their head. We have never been Elvis this, Elvis that to our children, because otherwise you're building up something that is almost unreachable for them. In February 2022, Navarone Garibaldi married Elisa Achille in Switzerland in an outdoor ceremony. The two became engaged in 2020, and Garibaldi told People, I never thought I would find a counterpart that is so understanding and supportive. She makes everything we do effortless, and I can't imagine life without her. Jerry Schilling, a talent manager and longtime friend of Elvis Presley, officiated the wedding. Achille noted she was ready to move on to the next chapter in their lives together, telling people, Navarone is truly the most genuine, sweet, and sensitive man I have ever known, and I'm so lucky that after four years of long distance, we can start our life together as husband and wife. Sadly, on January 12, 2023, tragedy struck the Presley extended family. Lisa Marie Presley died after being hospitalized following a reported cardiac arrest earlier in the day. It is with a heavy heart that I must share the devastating news that my beautiful daughter Lisa Marie has left us. A spokesperson for Priscilla Presley said, Priscilla Presley and the Presley family are shocked and devastated by the tragic death of their beloved Lisa Marie. They are profoundly grateful for the support, love, and prayers of everyone and ask for privacy during this very difficult time. The statement continued, Please keep her and our family in your prayers. We feel the prayers from around the world and ask for privacy during this time.